everyone and welcome to Journey with the Kellers. My name is Amanda Keller and today we are back in the Keller kitchen. So today we are actually going to be making something from the horror movie cookbook or the horror movie night cookbook. Today's recipe is called What's Your Favorite Scary Movie Popcorn? Um, and so this is from, from Scream of 1996. Um, so yeah, she's eating Jiffy Pop in it, and so this is supposed to be that. So there's actually two different versions of popcorn for this. One is brown butter lemon popcorn, and the other one is garlic parmesan popcorn. I'm gonna be making both, and then down in the uh, description, I will put times um, of where you can catch either, or if you wanna make both like I'm gonna do at one time, then make both at one time. The first thing that you are going to need to do for the brown butter lemon popcorn, which is what we're making first, is pop a microwave popcorn bag of popcorn. Now mine already has butter on it. I don't know that I've seen microwave popcorn without butter, might have, but we're gonna be adding more butter, but that's okay. So the, after you get your, micro, your popcorn popped up and in a bowl, what you're gonna do is you're gonna take a half a cup of unsalted butter, which is one stick, and melt it in a pan just until it turns brown. So here it is here in there melting up. Um, once it gets all melted, it'll probably take about one to two minutes to turn brown. Make sure you keep a really close eye on it though. You don't want it to burn. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and get this turned brown and then I'll be back and show you guys what we do next, okay? So I'll be right back guys. So our butter is nice and brown. And it does brown, it does go quick. So one minute it'll be yellow, the next minute you'll start seeing it turn brown. So this is all nice and brown. You're gonna shut it off of the heat. And then you're gonna take one lemon, and I don't wanna get any seeds in here, so I'm gonna use my hand so we don't get seeds down in there. And it is gonna pop and fizzle, because that's hot. So make sure you watch out for that as well. is half of a lemon and now we got to do the other half I'm, sorry, I'm just holding my hands over here to not get any seeds in there which I think all the nope there's a seed right there oops and I just dropped the seed in there should have used a sieve oh well Okay, let me get the seed out. Got it, good. Okay, so I'm just gonna stir that up real quick. And what you're gonna do is just pour this over top of your popcorn. And I don't wanna burn myself here. So you're just gonna pour this over top of it. And then kind of give it a toss and turn. Oh, I think I should've used the bigger bowl, but that's all right. Give it a little bit of a toss. I got lemon stickers sticking to me. Here we go. All right, so give it a nice toss. Try to get all the popcorn coated. There we go. Okay, so you got nice uh, brown butter popcorn there. Now you're gonna take another lemon and you're gonna squeeze this over top as well. And again, I'm gonna try not to get any seeds in there. Good idea to use a sieve if you have one. Sieve, sieve, however you want to say it. Okay, so there's one done. All right, almost got this one done. There we go. All right, and then just for like a little garnish, you're gonna take some lemon zest and just kind of grate it over top. Make sure I don't get the sticker in there. And you're gonna use about a tablespoon of lemon zest. The other one here too, or the other half I should say. Oh my goodness, about lost it. 
Okay, there we go. That should be enough. Now you can also divide this out into individual bowls and then garnish it with the lemon zest. That's up to you guys how you want to do that. But here it is all nice and done. This is the brown butter uh, lemon popcorn. So I think we should just give this a try and see how it tastes. Mm. Little lemony. My kids will love it. They love lemon. Me, not so much. A little bit too sour for my taste. But it is good. I will tell you that. Okay, you guys. So we've got this popcorn done. So I'll be back in just a minute. I got to set up for the garlic Parmesan popcorn. Oh, excuse me. And I'll show you guys how to do that. So I'll be back in just a minute. Okay, you guys. So for the garlic Parmesan popcorn, again, you're going to need a, another bag of microwave popcorn. This time you're going to melt three tablespoons of unsalted butter in a pan. So as you can see, I have already done that. Okay. Once it's all melted, you are going to go ahead and add in two cloves of garlic that's been minced. Now I am cheating and using already minced garlic. I know it's probably better to use fresh, but I'm out of time today. So we're just going to use that. And then you're also going to put in here two tablespoons of, uh, let's see. Oh, we got to stir this for one minute. Sorry. So stir that up real good. All right, there we go. And then you're going to add in two tablespoons of garlic salt. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no, we don't. My fault? Okay. So this, I guess, comes later. So you're going to go ahead and take this garlic butter once you've heated up the garlic a little bit. And you're going to pour it over top of here. Pour it over top of your, um, oops, the garlic stayed in there. Pour it over top of your popcorn. Okay, we're going to toss it up again. Make sure everything gets some garlicky butter on it. And of course, I'm getting some stuff on the floor, but that's okay. All right, there we go. Now you're going to go ahead and sprinkle this with about two tablespoons of garlic salt. It's a lot of garlic salt. So one. A little bit more okay two tablespoons of garlic salt i know i didn't measure it and then uh let's see and also a half a cup of grated parmesan cheese maybe oh okay it's about like a half a cup all right, now you're gonna to toss this again. Oh no, the dog's going after the popcorn. All right, you guys, and there we have it. Some garlic Parmesan popcorn. So let's give this a try. For me, that's much, much better than the lemon. Mm, that's delicious. I like that one. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay, you guys. So that's it for this video. I hope you liked it. Like and subscribe if you like or don't if you don't. Everybody have a good day. Enjoy your cooking. Keep your kitchen messy. And we'll see you later. Bye.